I need to finish this bad as soon as I can. And fortunately, it's almost over the winter. What's up boys and welcome to the vlog game. Maddie here as always. I mean, it's not perfect, but it's getting better. And when I say it's getting better, spring is almost here. So today it's a kind of a nice day during the winter. And I have, I want to do this bad extender for so long. And now it's the time. So the truck is getting a couple of things, but the first, is the bad extender and then another upload we're gonna put the tow mirrors if you're here for the first time make sure to subscribe so you're not gonna miss it the tow mirrors and as you can see the garage has a bunch of things the corvette is uh, on the side because i'm going i'm about to do bigger things so i'm working on a video as we speak or as we talk about this one but now let's talk about the rough country bad extender right so as you guys can see here i have everything ready to go here all the instructions here laying down so i could asset so everything's it's here so all the hardware they even send you the drill bit for the bad extender because this you have to drill that's the template that goes on the bad the instructions are pretty forward like should be straightforward but we'll see right i hope i don't have any issues so let's put that together and then we go from there all right this should be straightforward i guess um you have a couple of parts and that's everything that comes with the kit besides the hardware should be very straightforward i'll put it together and you guys see it and then i'll explain to be honest i didn't find any like how to videos here on youtube so maybe this is gonna be helpful for you but let's get that done This is the first step that you have to do. First thing, boy, just like if you have another person to help you, it's super straightforward. Those three bars, and then you attach that with those nuts there, right? And use, they even send you the, the island key. Pretty straightforward. So before you do anything, you gotta put this on because you're gonna be. Uh, this is uh, what you're gonna use to when you. We are using uh, the extender. These uh, are going to attach to the tailgate. So you need to put those on before you do anything. Okay? Now it's riding just like this. But with that out of the way, now we're gonna put the center part together and should be all assembled. is the next day you know i have to wait for the next day because i will i ran out of lights but i also figured out uh, that i made a mistake i had to flip uh the brackets and i'll explain exactly what happened because i'm telling you the structures from a rough country awful this one here uh i put it towards the inside and as you can see this little piece here has to be towards the outside as this one here you have to put it towards the inside. Uh, has to basically be like this, right? So this is the setup, right? So once it's facing like this, this is ready to go on the truck. Now, what do we have to do? We have to use those screws. Uh, I need a paint mark and I'm gonna use the template to drill on the truck. Here's the template, right? Uh, my truck has the bad rug, so I gotta remove everything and basically I'm gonna drill here. The challenge here is there's this curve when you put the bed liner, so the template cannot go there, right? Um, so it should be straight like this, but it has to be on the, the side like that. So you gotta do your best to measure like you know put it exactly where it should be i don't think it's a big deal if it's a little off 
but as close as you can get, the better it is. FedEx is just leaving and they drop off. It's not a car thing, but I might just show you guys. It's my new guitar, so I got a new guitar. <laughs> it's a Gratch. So I don't know if you guys are into guitars, but I'm pretty into guitars. So that was my gift for myself. Besides, the car is not actually a gift for myself. Well, I think it is. Well, anyway, let's back, go back to the truck. If you want to know more about the guitars, just let me know or follow my Instagram. You're going to see a bunch. I'm going to post there which guitar it is on Instagram. So I have to. My, or on my Facebook page. Don't forget, I have a Facebook page. Uh, if you're not into YouTube or Instagram, go to my Facebook page. There's a link below. So you definitely can follow everything there. So let's go back here, drill some holes. All right. The challenge, as I said, is to make this thing flush. So what I do, it's a paper so you can maneuver as much as you can. Try to line it up and shoot the beat right there. And you put your marker. I know I'm talking like this, but it is what it is. This template should work fine. Uh, and then you use the drill bit that they send you. Um, and I know, don't give me a hard time. I need new tools. So it's coming. We are upgrading them our, our stuff uh, a little by little. So. My, there's one step further that I need to go because I want to put the bracket over the, the, the bed rug, right? So it should be like this. So what I'm gonna do, I mean, it doesn't need to be precise, but I'm just gonna, there you go. One, two, three. So three holes on the bed rug. You gotta use those screws for it. Like they are small because they need to fit on the bracket. Here, here's the bracket. So, because if I put in my first one, the other ones should line up, right? So you put it there. There we go. Bracket in place, we should just come and attach the extender, I guess. Let's see. And of course, start right. Yes, baby! With that attached to the brackets, and it's very straightforward, they attach very easy. Uh, we need to install the, they call it bumper, uh, but you need to measure first the width of your bed, which in my case, it's already done. So now if you put this here, like this, that's how it should sit. Ow! There's a rubber piece that you, I mean, it's, this is very straightforward. Like, you know, you just slide in there, and that's it. It's always done working perfect unfortunately the weather today's rain it was rainy and i had to carry some stuff in the truck so i actually used this so it's really nice uh what i was about to show you guys is this right so every time you have the extender out you need this to be attached to so it's locked so this thing doesn't if try to fly it's not going anywhere and i'm saying like it's not going anywhere so very easy to use very easy to install so I just I'm just gonna demonstrate here for you guys so you guys can see because I have that thing locked you want to unlock and those are gonna pop out I hope you can see it there you go so with that everything pop out you just slide like this and close the gate that's it so let me put a couple of stuff here so you can try that thing see it works perfect and this is for the kind of thing i need this bed extender and also you know whenever you want it you just flip it over like this and then you have yourself a bed extender let me also show you how we remove because that's the other question it's pretty easy to 
It's like just those two pins that I showed you in the beginning. You just remove the pins that comes out. Pin one, pin two, and boom. How simple it is, and that makes your life so much easier. Put it back on, same way, same way, put it back on, close. Beautiful. A very easy stall, straightforward. Man, if you haul things like <laughs> water gallons, you should definitely get one. Uh, and also if you haul and you have a, a, a short bed like I do, I think that's also very helpful. And man, that's make life so much easier in many different ways. I hope you guys like it. Uh, truck is slowly, but it's getting together. Uh, I have way more to do. This is rough country, bed extender. There's so many different ones in the market. This is the one I chose. Everything is basically the same price range. So it's your choice. I chose the rough country because I, I had the rough country products all over. Why not, right? Next step for the truck, tow mirrors. So if you're here for the first time, make sure to subscribe and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Don't forget, enjoy life and work hard for it.